Hey, what is going on guys? It's Rusty here and I'm sorry for the delay in videos but I've had so many problems with computers and editing softwares but we are back and hopefully I'm going to continue this video spree. Alright, so what I'm here today is to show you how to create a YouTube banner or a channel cover. Basically, if you don't know what a channel cover is, it is the thing that shows off your profile in the background, like this here. And mine's quite simple, but I like it. And that's what I'm going to show you how to create today. My profile picture, just ignore, and I'm really sorry about that, but I am waiting for me to get Photoshop again, so I can create a new one, because I actually really like that one. <coughs> so, anyway... If you go into the top of my description or come over to Google and search up Photo Visi and it's the top one, you just click on that, wait for it to load and then what you want to do is click start creating and search for YouTube so you get your YouTube channel cover here and then just select that one and wait for it to load. So once it has loaded you can see it's the correct dimensions and you can't change that because it's a YouTube banner. So that's all good. You can add photo, you can either go to your computer, your Facebook or Instagram if you really want, or just search the web. I've got a few suggestions if you want to create a simple one, like Sunburst. Gives you some nice options and texture. It doesn't have to be blue, if you just search up texture it'll come up with a few quite nice ones actually <coughs> and I would recommend the texture as well as the sunburst but I'm just going to search up sunburst so I don't have to download it to my computer and select this one then it will automatically put it in the centre of your banner and you have now got that you have now got your banner background So. The opacity I wouldn't recommend changing because as you can see it can ruin it but I just keep that to full and move on. If you would like to add any shapes you're quite limited to shape, but shapes but there's a few cool ones so I'm just gonna get like this loading shape and I'm just gonna put two in both top corners to add and demonstrate the website a bit more to you guys but I'm just gonna put that in the corner there then you'll wanna add text and select your text and type whatever you like so I'm just gonna type in uh, rusty and change the colour to a red so it stands out as well as the font to a nice bold big font like oh that's quite cool actually and then I'm gonna put that into the middle just above you can't unfortunately change the size of your text but you can get a hashtag for your colour so once I've done that I'm going to cross this off and unselect my thing I'm just going to centre it a bit more right that'll do I've unselected it then I'm going to add another text and type banner maker test <coughs> and I'm going to move that underneath and make it as nice central as I can and then I'm also going to change this font but I'm going to stick to the same colour ske scheme as red black red and just to keep with the same colour scheme I'm going to add one more last text and it's going to say if I can actually get onto it, like, comment and subscribe if I can spell finally 
and then I'm also going to move that and try and get that centered. And as you can see that it looks quite nice how it gets smaller and larger every time. I'm just going to move this one down a bit more, even though it's just a test. And then move this one down a bit more. Alright, so I'm going to try and find the same one I used for the first piece of text as it actually suits, I guess. Capture it, that's what it's called. And if you want the exact same colour, you can copy and paste the colour and put it into there or not. Hmm. Right, anyway, oh, they are the same now. It's fine, it's fine. And then finally, you make your final adjustments to your banner. If you want to get off, you have to click this part of the bottom, by the way. And then I'm going to make the final adjustments, select this, move it to the other side that I completely forgot about. And yeah, that is my banner almost complete. You can change the background if you're not liking it so much, but then I'd click continue and it starts to download your banner you once it has downloaded it will show you what it will look like you click get your cover and it will start downloading and I always click show in folder so I know where it is and then move it to my pictures replace file in the destination and then what you can do is come over to YouTube change it and then you'll ju simply just select your new banner which is there and yeah I'm sorry for a break there's gonna be a giveaway coming up soon for all you guys that play CSGO and my channel is gonna be getting a lot more entertaining and I'm gonna start trying harder alright so hope you have enjoyed this video and I'll see you all next time peace